This is a video on how to use GeoGebra to create a dynamic parabola that is created from a directrix and a focus. So I'm starting here with a point. I'll create a second point and then a line through those points. That's my directrix. I'll put a point off the line which will be my focus. Remember the distance from the focus to the parabola and from the directrix to the parabola it always remains the same. So I put a point on the uh, directrix line and now to create the distances that I need I create a perpendicular from that point and then I draw a line from the focus to that point that's on the directrix and I'm thinking in terms of an isosceles triangle. So I create a, a point there so I can set up my angles. I measure this angle I create an angle at the focus the exact same size, put a point through there, and now I have my isosceles triangle where they intersect down in this zone is where we want to put the point for the parabola. Once we have that point for the parabola, we want to start hiding some of the information because it uh, uh, that line just won't hide for me uh, and now what we do is basically we can proceed and as we use the drag me it traces the point along the parabola now we can go to the settings and turn the trace on to see that. Remember though that the directrix can be changed, the focus can be changed, and that will change where the parabola is. All right, and drag me. So as we proceed through this, we set up some buttons here to trace the parabola and also to show the distances. So the distances from the focus to the point in the parabola and perpendicular down to the directrix will always remain the same. All right. So even as we drag that point, that distance remains the same. I can trace the parabola by putting the trace on. And I apologize, I can't get that one line to disappear for me. And as we do that, I can clear that because if I don't clear that and start moving the focus the trace remains on so I'm going to clear that now I'll make some adjustments and now trace the parabola again 